In this video, we'll be taking a look at three MLB games happening on May 23, 2024, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games, so six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports, let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three MLB games after after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. San Diego Padres vs. Cincinnati Reds Thursday's MLB action brings us to Great American Ballpark, where the San Diego Padres and Cincinnati Reds are set to clash in Game 3 of their series. The Padres, boasting the 8th best scoring offense in Major League Baseball, faced a tough challenge in the first game as the Reds held them to just 5 hits and no runs. Conversely, the Reds managed only 3 hits but capitalized on their opportunities to secure a 2-0 victory. However, it's unlikely that these outcomes will repeat themselves. Taking the mound for the Reds is Montes, whose earned run average sits at 4.37, a figure suggesting vulnerability. With only 25 strikeouts in 8 starts, Montes hasn't displayed the dominance expected of a starting pitcher. Recent outings have seen him concede 7 earned runs over 2 games, indicating a lack of shutdown potential. Additionally, the bullpen behind him ranks 13th in the majors with a team-earned run average of 3.91. Meanwhile, Waldron gets the start for San Diego, riding the momentum of a recent standout performance against Atlanta where he tallied 10 strikeouts in a winning effort. The Padres boast a lineup brimming with star power, featuring names like Taddy's JR, Machado, Bogarts, and Profar, all capable of swinging the game's momentum with a single hit. Their presence consistently applies pressure pressure on opposing pitchers, increasing the likelihood of errors and boosting run production. Montes, the red starter, has shown inconsistency throughout the season, making him susceptible to the offensive prowess of the Padres lineup. San Diego's ability to compete against top teams is evident from their recent series victory over the Braves. This ability to rise to the occasion against formidable opponents suggests a favorable outlook against a struggling Reds team, currently 20-28 with significant recent issues. Despite Monta's success at home this season, both starting pitchers have displayed vulnerability, with both teams underperforming as a whole. However, the Padres appear to be in better form this week so the San Diego Padres' money line is our full-game side pick. The Reds are renowned for their unconventional run manufacturing tactics, often relying on aggressive fast running to create scoring opportunities. Players like De La Cruz and Freel excel in this regard, utilizing their speed and skill to pressure opposing defenses. Against Waldron, who has struggled with a five-earned run average and susceptibility to allowing bass runners, the Reds could exploit this aspect of their game to notch runs. Conversely, the Padres boast a lineup loaded with star talent, including Taddy's JR, Profar, and Machado, capable of explosive offensive displays. Their recent period of rest, with the last three games spaced over 33 hours, could rejuvenate their offensive capabilities. Facing Montes, whose inconsistency is reflected in his 4.37 earned run average, the Padres have an opportunity to capitalize on any lapses and rack up runs. Both Waldron and Montes have struggled to contain opposing offenses this season, evident from their elevated earned run averages and susceptible ability to home runs. Waldron's daytime performances have been particularly concerning, with a balloon 7.56 earned run average in afternoon games. In their previous encounter this season, Waldron conceded four earned runs against the Reds in six innings. With the Padres ranking eighth in run production, they're poised to rebound from their scoreless outing in the series opener and make a statement with their potent lineup. Given the pitching matchup and the offensive capabilities of both teams, it's reasonable to expect ample scoring opportunities. Therefore, over the projected total is our full game total pick. Colorado Rockies vs. Oakland Athletics Thursday's matchup sees the Colorado Rockies taking on the Oakland Athletics at the Oakland Coliseum in Oakland, California. In their previous encounter last season, the Athletics emerged victorious in two out of three games played in Colorado. Moreover, they continued their winning streak by clinching the series opener on Tuesday night, putting an end to their recent string of losses. The upcoming game will feature Feltner on the mound for the Rockies, who has struggled away from home this season, tallying a record of 1-4 with a 6.55 earned run average in six 
road starts. On the flip side, S will be making his first home start of the year and only the second of his career, making him somewhat of an unknown factor in this scenario. However, the Athletics boast an impressive bullpen record, standing at 9-5 with 11 saves and a 3.69 earned run average. These two teams find themselves where many anticipated them to be this season. The Rockies are languishing at the bottom of the American League East, while the Athletics are faltering as they play out their remaining games in Oakland before their scheduled relocation. The pitching matchup doesn't instill much confidence or excitement, as evidenced by Felder's sparse win record in nine starts and S's recent rough outing against the Astros. Despite this, the Athletics have shown signs of offensive prowess this month, contrasting with the Rockies' ongoing struggles on the road. Should the hosts encounter difficulties with their young starter, I have confidence in their bullpen to steady the ship and in their offense to capitalize against the Rockies' struggling pitching staff. Therefore, the Oakland Athletics' money line is our full game side pick. In Tuesday's game, these two teams combined to score nine runs, matching the projected total for this matchup. Throughout the season, they have collectively exceeded the over in 49 games. Additionally, two of their three meetings from last season also surpassed the projected total. Despite both starting pitchers coming off subpar performances, they are poised to face relatively weaker offenses, suggesting a likelihood of runs being scored. Oakland's offense has displayed consistency by scoring at least four runs in each of their last two games prior to Wednesday, with a notable home field advantage. Meanwhile, Colorado has managed to score at least four runs in six of their last seven games. Entering Wednesday's action, Colorado has seen the over in 25 out of 47 games this season. They rank 23rd in the majors in runs per game, averaging 3.96 runs, with a slight dip to 3.64 runs per game on the road. On the other hand, Oakland has witnessed the over in 24 out of 50 games played, with an average of 3.7 runs per game and a slightly higher average at home. Despite a seemingly low total due to the pitcher-friendly park, I anticipate both offenses to deliver on Thursday, making over the projected total our full game total pick. Baltimore Orioles vs. Chicago White Sox In the opening game of an American League series, the struggling Baltimore Orioles visit the Chicago White Sox, who play as the home team. The Orioles enter this matchup on the heels of a series sweep in their previous outing and have suffered defeat in four of their last five games. Over their last ten games, they've managed a 4-6 record placing them in second position in the American League East with a 29-18 record, trailing the New York Yankees by three games. Conversely, the White Sox find themselves in a dire situation, having lost five of their last six games. With a dismal record of 15-35, they hold the unenviable distinction of possessing the worst record in all of baseball. Despite the calendar indicating it's only May 23rd, the White Sox already trail the American League Central leaders by a staggering 18 games. As both teams converge for this season, Series, their recent performances underscore their struggles. Baltimore's recent three-game losing streak contrasts with Chicago's five losses in the last six outings. However, despite their recent setbacks, Baltimore remains above the .500 mark and remains in contention for a playoff berth, whereas Chicago faces a significant deficit, already trailing the division leaders by a considerable margin. Pitching will play a crucial role in this matchup. Rodriguez, for the Orioles, has demonstrated prowess in his recent starts, maintaining a clean sheet in his last two outings. Facing a Chicago lineup that ranks at the bottom of the league in runs scored, Rodriguez appears poised for another strong performance. Conversely, Clevinger, while showing glimpses of adequacy, has struggled to pitch deep into games, often relying on the White Sox bullpen, which has been a relatively bright spot for the team. Consequently, while Baltimore may not score abundantly, Chicago's offensive woes are likely to persist. Reflecting on recent trends, Baltimore has faced difficulties against right-handed pitching throughout May. Clevinger's pitching history, marked by a propensity for allowing hard-hit balls, suggests an opportunity for Baltimore's offense to rebound convincingly. Thus, the Baltimore Orioles to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Considering Chicago's offensive struggles, characterized by a frequent inability to muster more than three runs in a game, and their bullpen's recent reliability, yielding a commendable earned run average and WHIP, a low-scoring affair seems probable when they clash with Baltimore. Should Rodriguez maintain his recent form, Chicago's lineup faces a formidable challenge. Meanwhile, Baltimore's bullpen, while not exceptional, has shown promise with a respectable earned run average and FIP over their last 10 games. While the Orioles possess a potent line 
China. Their recent offensive output has been underwhelming. Conversely, the White Sox, languishing at the bottom of the league in runs scored, face a daunting task against Rodriguez, who has been lights out in his recent starts. With both teams likely to struggle offensively, under the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.